Not only is April National Donate Life Month, but also today is National Siblings Day. WBRE WYOU Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Rogers combines the celebrations with a heartwarming story of a kidney donation between sisters. When my daughter was one year old, I was diagnosed with chronic kidney disease. That's when she was told she had only around seven years left to live. Two of my sisters stepped up to the plate. The first one was my oldest sister, Mary Beth. And unfortunately, days before the transplant, it was canceled because doctors thought that doing a transplant on my sister, Mary Beth, would harm her. Next up, her second sister, Cecilia Shimola. Cecilia um, turned out to be a positive match. And thank goodness, um, our transplant was July 27th in 2004. So this is our sweet 16 of the kidney transplant. You know, I just went through the process to do what I could because I knew that my younger sister needed, needed something and if I could do it, why not do it? There are many misconceptions about being an organ donor. One of the biggest being that many people believe you have to be deceased to donate your organs. Most people are born with two kidneys and that you can live a full productive life with only one kidney. It's an incredibly powerful gift to give to someone that tangibly improves their life, how they feel every day. At the end of the day, these three all have the same message. Look into being a living organ donor. I call Cecilia my living angel. If she had not stepped in, I wouldn't be here today doing this interview. So be a living donor so people can have their life back. Nicole Rogers, 2822 Eyewitness News.